living in Warrington. If you're looking at different areas and are debating where to move, Warrington might be a good place to consider. With plenty of new construction as well as beautiful historic homes, there's no shortage of great properties on the market in this area. Let's talk about the housing in Warrington. So whether you're looking for a spacious colonial style home or a three-story townhome with a garage or even a country estate with acres of land, you're going to be able to find it in Warrington. In downtown Warrington specifically, there's a mix of housing options. So you'll find modest single-story homes, you'll find typically mid-century modern homes, homes. You'll find homes with two bedrooms all the way up to six bedrooms. So one of the great things about downtown is that it has a lot of shopping and dining options. And there's also a lot of fun events that take place. Let's talk about Central Warrington. So in Central Warrington, you'll find a variety of architectural styles. A lot of the houses have been built in the last two to three decades. So they're kind of newer condition. Most of the properties also have big yards. They're spacious. And there's also a lot of new construction communities still popping up in and around this area. These new communities that are popping up, there's a lot of single family homes with prices starting in the 500s. One of them is Broad Run at Brookside, which has a lot of four bedroom homes with three car garages. The community is also filled with amenities like pools, sport facilities, and a fitness center. Warrington Chase is another community located closer to the downtown area. Homes in Warrington Chase have beautiful wooded lots, and there are a variety of floor plans that you can pick. Millfield is another new community that has customizable floor plans and has a really nice convenient location right off the highway. Regardless of the type of home that you're looking for, you're more than likely going to be able to find it in Warrington. It's just a matter of where you want to live, whether you want to have that country lifestyle, whether you want to have the downtown and access to all those shops, or if you want something new construction like some of those communities that I mentioned. Compared to other areas in Northern Virginia, you're probably also going to need a little bit more for your money in Warrington. Some of the places farther north are much more expensive. Overall, Warrington is a very nice place to live, along with a lot of the other places in Northern Virginia. So it's always about figuring out what's the right place for you, your job, your lifestyle, school zones, all those different things that matter when it comes to purchasing a home. So if you're interested in working with an agent in the area that really knows and understands this region, you're going to have to work with one anyways. You might as well work with the experts. So reach out to us if you are moving to the area and we can help you find your dream home. Also, you can click the link in the description to see all of the current homes available in Warrenton, Virginia. Thanks for checking out this video. Subscribe and we'll see you on the next one.